they think it's a cosmetic or a skin related disease, but it's far from that. It's capable of producing tumors that can easily take a life. Eric Sizemore of Tip City is fighting for his life. Two and a half years ago, he was diagnosed with stage three melanoma. Since that time, we've kept in touch with Jay and um, Eric's journey has gotten a little more difficult. Uh, he, he, his cancer continued to pro progress through um, several treatments. Through internet research, Eric's wife Jill found another melanoma patient in Australia. His condition matched that of Eric's. I was diagnosed with stage 3 melanoma in 2008 um, and then about six or seven months later I got an email off of Jill and Eric um, telling me that they're going through exactly what I just went through and um, yeah I, I emailed them straight back and we've been in contact ever since. Through the threat of illness, Jay Allen of Australia and the Sizemores of Tip City have forged a bond. Eric is going through aggressive treatment to arrest the tumors that have spread to his brain. Jay has always been there for encouragement, and now his trip to the U.S. adds to the support for the Sizemores. People coming to our home, bringing us meals. We, had, um, we would find taped to our front door envelopes with money in them. We would get cards in the mail with no return address with money in them. We had people um, at church that heard our story and um, raised money for us. 